My name is Miklos Balog and I'm from Vinsula, BC, which is a town of around 50 people. Up to the point that I left about eight months ago, there was never really anything for me besides some base level classes, and even those were overshadowed by the reality that most of the people there would go on to work on farms for the rest of their lives. At that point, I was lucky enough to be able to leave and go study to boarding school, but there I was sort of confronted with the fact that I didn't have much of the basis that's required to understand the ways in which the things I'm learning are applied to the world around me, and I'd like to do something about that this summer. History, and in particular that of it stored in the World Wars, really excites me because it's an abundance of information that is completely relevant to the world we live today, and it's just becoming more and more so as time goes on. It would also be really nice to visit the grave of my great-great-grandfather because he was killed in World War One, and no one's had the chance to go visit him. I think to promote any change in my community really goes back to those attitudes of disregarding anything that isn't farming and also drinking. And if change was to be made, it would have to be done in an interactive and friendly way and before that social attitude of nonchalance that's created by textbooks and online courses sets in. For this topic, I think that would be some activities in elementary schools during Remembrance Day because all of the ceremonies are way too far for people to bother attending. If I was selected to attend the Beaverbrook program, I would bring the experience of someone whose passions and aspirations are self-made, not made by the environment and the people around them, and also value in the way that I at least somewhat understand how learning is alienated and disregarded in a lot of areas around the world and some of the implications that can have and even to an extent, I think, ways to go about working with that. And I know that a lot of those voices are not the loudest in areas where innovating and educating play a prominent role, but I know how big of a part of my life that's been and how big of a part of many other lives it is, and I hope it's something that would hold significance in other areas of the world as well.